Now this one, and I want y'all to understand, during the celebration, Jerry got hurt pretty, yes. pretty, pretty bad. And uh, Brea broken and everything else. But he had this mare, and I'm proud to say it's my mare, in there, and he decides he's going to do a clipping, and he's going to do it with her. And I was tickled because she's the one that uh, I've got for sale, but it shows how much sense some of these horses have. And this is the first time this filly had been caught out of a stall and everything in the cross <coughs> stall suit. Being the first time, but well, we got her into the stall and like never caught her. Once you got her yeah. caught, we did fool around with her a little bit, but then you brought her into the cross tie and it's the first time she'd ever been in the cross tie. And he decides to trim her. So I want everybody to just kick back and enjoy this because it gets good. Ladies and gentlemen, here I am, Gary Williams, here at Big Big Table. We got this skill here for the first time, LP Clip. You know, I try to clip mine without holding on twitch and teach him, try to teach him a lesson right here. So we're gonna start off with a nose first. We're gonna get here, we're gonna trim a nose there. You know, she gonna thrash around a little bit, but you know, that comes forward with, with horses and all that stuff, they animals. And you just try to teach them, but ain't no sense of fighting them and make them do things that they don't really want to do, you know. But you just sit there, and you keep it kind of confined with the head down, when it can't rail up, you know, or fight you, or nothing like that. But you just take your time, and be patient. You can teach them a lot of stuff. A lot of people want to do it the quick way, but last, a lot of times, fashion is make the best. But now you hold on right here. Now she might, she looks like she may throw a little bit here. You got her eyes all big. Right here, we clip over our eyes a little bit. Whoa, whoa, baby. Good girl, good girl, good, good. You're doing good. Oh, and just be patient. Oh, now. And we're going to try something right here. We're going to try to clip over her head, her brow pants right here, and see can we get her to relax. And you can always tell when a horse goes to relaxing because their eyes won't show so much white in there. You know, and she just kind of giving in. And she knows that she's caught. And everything. Whoa, baby. Whoa. Take your time. Easy. Now, well, we're going to try some here, ladies and gentlemen. Now, this might be a disaster, but we're going to try it anyway. Whoa, 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 now. Easy. See, she, she, see how her eyes got bucked up right there? She made my eyes buck up a little bit. You got to kind of watch her. Just a little. Whoa, now. Easy. You always got to do it. Now, we're just going to stay here and she gonna, she'll learn that she's going to feel like that she can't do what she want to do. we got to sit here and we got to hold now. Easy, girl. Easy, girl. Easy. Now, take your time. Easy. Whoa, I know this is your first time, but this might be your first time to be in a world grand champion. Your first clip. We're going to make you see him and make you look beautified here. So you you got to kind of watch him. And everything. What are we doing? She's doing a good job right here. Good girl. Clipping these horses for the first time, it ain't for the week holding. You got to have a little nerves to do this. Because the more you jump, the more they're going to jump. They feel comfortable. If you are comfortable, they're going to feel comfortable. Full oh, now. Full oh, girl. Now. Make sure we don't cut too far that back on that brow pass that whoa now. Whoa now. She gonna look a lot different when we get through here. Oh now, whoa. Now we're gonna ease down and we're gonna wipe some of this off of her. Whoa, baby. Easy now. Good girl. Good, good now. Good. We're gonna get that boat out. Up a little bit. We'll try to straighten it up a little bit. And we're going to try to, to thin that thing out a little bit with her not throwing a fit. Well, you know, little thing tickling on her ear right here. Whoa, now. Whoa, whoa. Now. We're going to try to trim up a little bit. And, when, you know, most time when I clip one, I clip down instead of up. Because if you clip up and she jump, you can cut a whole photo off. But you try to take it and tell her easy. Easy, everything gonna be alright. Just kind of grab her ear right there and just let her just 
Focus and go downwards. Go down stroke. Oh yeah. I don't want to cut too much off of her full top because I don't know what kind of position she's gonna make. She might make a show performance horse or she might be a pleasure horse. And a lot of pleasure horses like a lot of full top. Now we're gonna do some here. That might be a little dangerous, but we're gonna try. We're gonna try to clip her ears. Without no twitch. Now I want everybody to look and see. There's no twitch around the ears. So here we go. One, two, three. Let's go. Let's try. Let's see what happens. Whoa now. Easy. 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 Whoa. A lot of time you talk to them. You tell them how much you really care about them. And how precious they are and how beautiful they're going to be. A lot of time it works. A horse is just like a human. If you sit there and talk nice to them, you can get a lot more done with them than talking ugly and rude to them. And I have worked around a lot of people that talk ugly and rude to people. And whoop it. Easy, easy, see she? But she gonna relax, see, you didn't, you didn't talk back. I didn't jump, didn't run. She just, she gonna have a reaction because she's animal. You know, she gonna be all right. She be all right, she's... Just like I said, she's a young one. Well, now, easy. Take your time. The next time you get clipped, you'll be a lot better. Well, now, easy. You know, ain't no sense of getting up here and getting something and thrashing them or something like that, you know. You just take your time and talk to them. Because they're baby, they don't know. Well, now, girl. Easy. It'll be all right. I'm just trying to make you a show. I'll tell you, this is pretty good for the first time. Yeah. Ain't too bad. You know, we ain't going to do a great job. We just want to get the basics down and just kind of clip her just a little bit where she kind of gets used to it. Just a little bit. Well, now, we ain't going to fight her too much. We're just trying to get her where she just... Easy. We're gonna relax. So let her relax. Rub on a little bit. We're just kind of get used to it. We're gonna try to get a little bit more of this hair off his ear. Just a little bit more. And next time we clip her, she'll be a lot easier. She kind of have the idea of what she's supposed to be doing. Okay. Well, well, easy now. Easy. Relax. Relax. Take your time. Oh, nice. You know, that ain't the best job it is, but she's pretty good to say she hasn't had this done. Oh. Oh, nice. Now, this is the way I do it. Now, I ain't saying that everybody has to do it this way, but this is the way I do it. Go on now. She's doing your other but you just kind of sit there and you talk to her. And you tell her easy, everything will be all right. Everything's gonna be good. Oh man, easy. Patience is the best thing when you're fooling with a horse. If you ever wake up in the morning and you don't have a lot of patience, don't fool with a horse that day. Because these horses got to have patience. Mm -hmm. Whoa. Oh man, easy. Easy. We didn't cut our eyebrows off. We just cut our eyelashes at the bottom. We just kind of cut them off a little bit. Now we're going to try another ear and see how this goes. Whoa. We're almost there. you almost done. you halfway done. Let's see how this works. Easy. Easy. Take your time. Good girl. Wonderful. 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 We try to get this done without having no kind of chaos and no kind of fighting or wrestling or anything like that. And let her be this a good experience for her for the first time. 
You know, just like I say, horses just like people. The first experience is the best experience. Oh, man. You know, it's taking me a little longer than it normally it would, but you got to realize, this is the first time. Did she ever had this done? First time lady Jim, she had been to cross ties. It's one thing I love doing is going with these young coats like that, clipping for the first time. Kind of imprinting them. Whoop, whoop, that was close. Almost broke them, but I caught them. <laughs> That would have been bad right there, ladies and gentlemen. You know, these things cost pretty high. <laughs> and you know, around here at J&J Stables, we work on a budget. <laughs> I think I've been having these clips ever since I was a kid. <laughs> oh, it's easy. Almost done. Almost. We ain't gonna aggravate you too much more this time. Let's trim this full top up just a little bit more. Let's see, can we get her just a little bit? Like I say, I'm going away from my full top. Down from it, not towards it. Because you know, if you ever look at a horse and he don't have no full top, somebody clipped towards the full top. And he jumped and he cooked it off. I have had a few people in my lifetime I know have done that before. Oh man, easy girl, easy. Now look how much better that look than she did when she first started off. Look, easy girl, easy, easy now. I'm gonna let my camera keep filming right there and I'm gonna get this brush and I'll brush her off, brush her whole top off to make her look presentable. I'm back. <laughs> <laughs> Let's take our time and then let her just kind of get used to it. Well now, easy. She, she's smart, I tell you. Little jumpy, but now her bloodline makes her look jumpy. Oh baby, slow now. Easy. What we're gonna do is we're gonna flip this mane on the other side here. We're gonna do all in one in this mare in one day. We clip her, brush her, call her, all oh, one day. I tell you, Jerry, doing that, I found out you can for an old man, you can move pretty fast. <laughs> when she gets rowdy. You, you gotta be quick on your feet sometimes. But now this is the one that I posted on Facebook. I had told different people that I was gonna try doing some auction on Facebook. We've got a lady that has bid 5,000 on this one right here. So, November the 30th, whoever's the high bid, gonna own her. I tell you, that's a that's a real pretty filly too. Oh, sure. I mean, she's, she's pretty. She's pretty. She moves good. Yes. She's pretty smart. Yeah, she is. I think she'd be the right size for any horse, you know, any person yeah, or something like that, you know. A, she's not going to be a real big horse. Not a big one, or a little, but I think she's going to be the right size and, you know, well, you can have a lot of fun with her. 